Greetings to all our parents and our primary six students who have completed, successfully completed your primary education and now embarking on a secondary education. Congratulations for that. And as you embark on your secondary education, I would like to give you a quick overview of what this school is, is like. But before that, I am Mr. Sulaiman, Principal of Greendale Secondary School. And before I start talking about Greendale Secondary School, let me share a little bit more about myself because I do believe that you would want to know a little bit more about the principal when you choose the school as well. I am a father of four children and all my four children are grown up now. Two of them, the first two of them are girls and they are both teachers. One of them is already in a school and a se the second, my second daughter is about to start teaching. My two boys are in poly and pursuing their interests in film, video and sound and games development. If anything, my four children taught me that every child is different. They came through a same education or same upbringing from parents, me and my wife, but they are all different and they all stand for different interests and different talents. So that is something which taught me that every child is different and we need to treat the children differently as well. So as we do that, we also remember there's something which is very common, which is character and values education. So skills can be different, talents and interests can be different, but we cannot compromise on character and values education. So indeed, character development is a key component of a child's development. And in Greendale Secondary School, our anchor is character development. And every Monday, for instance, there is a, a video from the principal to tell the children about different character traits and also to share some stories. We also have the spotlight on Fridays when students get to know about current affairs and what's happening around in the world. And apart from that, we place a lot of emphasis on the moral character, so learning character traits like respect, responsibility, and at the same time, performance character, which place emphasis on resilience, diligence, perseverance, and excellence. So we do ba uh, balance these two of them, so that on one hand, we have performance character, on the other hand, we have moral character, to ensure that our students use character not just to develop themselves as a person, but to also upskill themselves because performance character allows them to do well and excel in their studies, in the skills, as well as in their interest and talent area. Thus, the importance of character development. And because we place so much importance in character development, in our school, we are happy to say the tone and discipline has been rather good. And we hope to continue this because the students love the school because we love them. Loving the school, of course, our students do, because this is a school they build together with all the teachers and the rest of the staff. So in Greendale, for example, there's a lot of opportunity for students to add their, add their views and give their feedback. So we have, for instance, the town hall where all our SEC 1 and SEC 3 students are involved and we get into discussions of issues of concern for them and get feedback from the students through the town hall. We also have the focus group discussion and during focus group discussion, students give a lot of feedback as well. And through the feedback, we have made quite a bit of changes and this has made the school a better school indeed. So right now, for instance, I'm at the student hub this student hub is a place where students come in to have lots of fun and also spend time after school so that they can connect with one another and do some form of collaboration. And there's a lot of many other places like this in the school where the students get to gather, get to know one another, and at the same time, invest time on their interest area as well as their talent. So this is a school built for the students. Greendale is a school which places a lot of emphasis on teaching and learning. We have commendable academic results, uh, value added, and at the same time, we also place a lot of emphasis on making our lessons very meaningful, engaging, and fun for our students. So you can expect lessons which are collaborative in nature, where students are coming together and learning from one another, 
which are thought provoking where a lot of questions are asked and students answer those questions and in the process learn and gain knowledge and a classroom setting which allows for students to think through and create their own knowledge together with the teachers rather than the teachers just pass them down the knowledge. So we work very hard to develop our students to be collaborative and thinkers at the same time. Thus our school's vision, learner, thinker and leader. And in the process, our students get to enjoy their lessons and have a meaningful learning experience in the classrooms. In Greendale, our students shine like a star. And why is that so? Because we have our talent development program, which is also tagged to our student leadership. Our comprehensive student leadership program means that our student gets an opportunity to take on leadership role, even at the basic level. Even in the classroom, they are, every one of them are peer support leader. And as a leader, they look out for one another. And some others are also peer support leader at a higher level where they actually care for and look out for one another at the school level, which is beyond the class. And so in student leadership, we have a variety of positions available for students to take on, which include student council, CCA leaders, CCA ambassadors, and many more. And beyond that, we also have our talent development program where in every subject, Students are identified for their talent and stretched to maximize their talent based on the learning disposition needed for that particular subject area. Students coming into our school actually embark on this program where 10% of the students are chosen to go into this active talent development program where the students are given a variety of exposure in different areas which include languages, science and technology, uh, design thinking and as well as exploring possibilities of how to make things happen. Every school is a good school. However, every school also have their distinct programs. So it is important for one to understand these programs as you go on to decide which school you want to join. So in Greendale Secondary School, we have two distinct programs. The first one is what we call Applied Learning Program or ALP. And as part of that program, our students get to understand a little bit more about design thinking and more about design and science, robotic, and how machines work as well. And that's a very engaging experience for all our students. So for example, all our SEC2 students are trained in design thinking and they go through a process to look into a problem and solve that problem. They even get an opportunity to work with Singapore Institute of Technology or SIT. So that's our first program, the Applied Learning Program. And the second program, second distinct program for us is our Learning for Life program, which is on outdoor adventure. So we have, you would realize in our school, we have rock walls and we also provide a lot of opportunities like kayaking, canoeing, dragon boating, cycling, and many more outdoor related exposure so that you get a very enjoyable school experience which is related to outdoor events. And the third area we are actually exploring and looking into now is sustainability. And next year we're starting a green club and beyond green club, we are also looking at different ways to see how we can make our school emphasize a lot more on sustainability and go green further. We are one of the first schools to embark on full subject-based banding, which means the whole school are now on full subject-based banding, where the students can take a variety of subjects from different courses, be it in Express, NA or NT. All right, so, so they can actually blend all these together and have a very meaningful experience. And the classes in our school are also mixed classes for our form classes before they go into breakout group for the respective different courses. So there's a lot of opportunity to mix with one another from SEC 1 to SEC 5. It's a full subject-based bending school we have here. Our CCAs are also very unique. So we have CCAs like canoeing, we have outdoor adventure, fencing, floorball and many more. So do find out a little bit more about our CCAs and you will realise that there's a lot to choose for in Greendale. As a school, we place a lot of emphasis on partnership because we believe that when we partner with 
uh, external organizations and industries, we are able to provide an even more enriching experience for our students. And this means there's a lot of partnership in schools. We have uh, many partnerships and partners, and that has actually helped us to enrich the learning for the students. But let me just give you three examples. We are the pioneer schools to, in Pongol to start partnership with Singapore Institute of Technology. So all our SEC2 students work with SIT to get to know a little bit more about design thinking and they use the design thinking principles to solve a problem identified by SIT. Another strong partner we have, again, we are the first to do that in secondary school, is Pileba Airbase. With Pileba Airbase, we have an opportunity where we are able to go, or go over there and our students get to experience the Airbase experience, which is something very unique and we are very privileged to have that opportunity. Right, uh, open house, uh, beyond open house, we also get to interact with them, get to engage with uh, some form of communication with them where we understand a little bit more about some of the challenges and some of the career prospects. And so Pilot by Airbase is a partner we are working very closely with. The third example I want to give you is Cloversoft and we work with them closely on sustainability. And going beyond sustainability, we are also working with them on how to tap on technology to make sure that we are able to reach out to more people on the importance of sustainability and going green. So in our school, for instance, when in the green effort, we have three emphases. One is to provide, bring about a community spirit and contribute to the community in green effort. And second is to work towards our students developing entrepreneurial skills. And third, to use technology to promote green to the next level. So all this is possible because we work very closely with partners like Cloversoft. And one other partner I can think of currently is Pungol Shaw Urban Farm. We also work very closely with them. So partnership is something we are very fortunate to have. And that has made learning a very good, rich experience for our students. All schools are good schools. So you need to decide which school suits you the best. And one of the first things to consider in deciding your school is accessibility. It should be some place near your place or a school which is easily accessible from your place. So that makes you don't worry too much about transportation or moving from point to point. Right, so that's very important. And beyond that, you want to look at the school's program and make sure the school have engaging program which helps you, which is connects with you. Okay, all schools have very interesting engaging programs, but which is the program which helps you or uh, get you excited are very important. And finally, the most important thing to do is to walk around the school and see or ask yourself how you feel. Do you get a feel good factor? And some people will get that in one school, some others will get that in another school. And this one final tip, ask a lot of questions to the students and ask them about the school. And I hope, and I'm confident in Greendale, they will give you honest feedback. And that will help you to decide as well. All the best.